Spend some time with us, catch a ride with us. Come along and we'll take you to tomorrow, tomorrow, when the kingdom of could be you. There's a farmer, could be you. There's a teacher, could be you. Quarterback, lumberjack, could be you. Butcher, baker, dressmaker, could be you. Look at all the things people do. Look what could be you. What's it doing under the sea? Could be you. Could be me. What are they doing over there? What a stop and see. Hey, look at all of these possibilities. All the wonderful things to do. So let's begin to see what's in the kingdom of could be. This is about growing things <laughs> and animals. Put something in a seed. Get something out you need. That's what the world is all about. Putting things in, getting things out. So this is the land where food comes from. Oh, it's more than that. I call it the land of ins and outs. It looks like a farm to me. Wow, I didn't know food grew by magic. I think it's a lot of work. That's not magic. What? What that guy did, he just put a seed in the ground. And out popped the food. Yes. Well, farming takes more than magic, I'm afraid. It's a lot more than just throwing a seed in the ground, Thad. There's a lot to take care of, a lot to do. Like watering. Mm -hmm. And protecting the plants from bugs and birds. And feeding and fertilizing. And harvesting, you know, gathering the food when it's ready. Okay, okay, I agree. Still sounds like fun to me. And looks like magic. Come on, let's try it. Put something in. A seed. Get something out. You need. That's what the world is all about. Putting things in. Getting things out. This apple I grew tastes great. How do you like my tomatoes? Terrific. And my carrots are muy sabrosas. What's the matter, Thad? Look what I grew. How am I going to eat something like this? Oh, my! You make clothes from that, Thad. You mean this is cotton? Hmm. I've heard of that somewhere. Right here, in the land of ins and outs, we grow cotton and other fiber crops from which we make thread and cloth for clothes. How do you like that? I can grow clothes. If they'd ask me, I could tell them other things we grow to make clothes. Could you? <laughs> Hey, you guys, look what I found. Aren't they cuddly? You can make cloth from sheep fur, too, can't you, wizard? That's right. It's called wool. Like I always say, we raise sheep to get their wool for our clothes. Are you trying to outdo me? Why would I do that, Dad? We need clothes from both wool and cotton. Hey, Wiz, isn't this the same animal you get lamb chops from? That's right, Thad. Not my little lamb, you don't. <laughs> Look at all these animals. Don't you just love them? They need lots of care. And if we treat them right, they'll give us special things in return. Let me show you. Put something in. Get something out to share. That's what the world is all about. Putting things in, getting things out. Look at all these eggs and milk. Mmm, yum. And look what I made from the milk. Cheese and butter. See what I mean? When you put in the effort, you get out a lot of satisfaction. That's why you call this the land of ins and outs. Did you see where Thad went? Look out, here he comes again. Yeah! He's a cowboy, trying to rope a steer with his lasso. 
What happened, Dad? Are you all right? Don't ask. You know, I love to grow things, and I love taking care of animals. And this is a neat part of the kingdom. But... And I really appreciate the whole idea of ins and outs. But... But... When you ride like a cowboy, and you catch a steer in your lasso, you better hold on tight, or you'll fly out of your saddle in a big hurry. <laughs>